go. Ready? Go. Hi, I'm Miss Barb. Um, I wanted to introduce my dog Cooter today. He's eating Cheerios right now and playing. And I'm going to read a story. Sit, Marley, sit. Marley couldn't wait for his first day of obedience school. Neither could his family. Cassie and baby Louie hoped that Marley would finally learn to fetch. Mommy and Daddy would be happy if Marley finally learned to heal. But as the family pulled into the school's parking lot, Marley grew nervous. Don't worry, Marley, Cassie said. It'll be fun, you'll see. Marley spotted the other puppies in his class and decided that maybe Cassie was right. He bolted toward the training grounds. Marley, wait, Dad cried after chasing him. Then he saw the dog trainer step right into Marley's path. That was Marley, Daddy told the teacher. Sorry, he can be a little naughty sometimes. Most times, Mommy added. There are no bad dogs, only bad owners, the teacher said sharply. She stared at Mommy and Daddy. Now, who is working with Marley today? Mommy and Daddy glanced at each other. He is, Mommy said. She is, Daddy said at the same time. Mommy and Daddy tossed a, toy, a coin to choose who would be in charge of training Marley. Daddy lost. First, the owners had to show their dogs who was boss. Marley figured out that, out that one right away. Next, Daddy tried to teach Marley a command. Sit, good boy. He ordered, but Marley didn't want to sit. He wanted to smell the daffodils over by the oak tree. He wanted to smell them right now. Sit, good boy. <laughs> you have to be firm with your dog or else he'll never behave, the instructor scolded Daddy. Let me show you how it's done. Stay, heel. After school, the teacher wanted to talk to the family about Marley. I don't think Marley is ready for obedience training, she explained. At least not in my class. Maybe you shouldn't bring him back ever. Kicked out of puppy school. It was hard for the family to believe. Actually, it wasn't that hard. He tried to warn her that Marley was special, Daddy said. You mean naughty, don't you? Mommy asked. Right, Daddy said. Come on, everybody. It's time to take our naughty dog home. You speak. The drive back was quiet. Mommy and Daddy brought baby Louie inside the house. Cassie stayed in the yard to practice with Marley, even though he hadn't learned a thing about behaving. An hour later, Mommy called them in for lunch. Marley raced so fast to the bowl that he knocked into the kitchen table. Spaghetti hit the ceiling, meatballs flew across the room. Cassie and Daddy tried to help clean up, but it was no use. Sit, just sit. Everybody sit, Mommy shouted. Then, whoop, Waddy, baby Louie yelled. He pointed at Marley who was sitting. Marley had learned to behave after all, sort of. Sit. Sit. Speak. 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 Thank you.